<laughs> it ain't the fucking Bill Maher show, Bill. <laughs> or the John Oliver show. Uh, uh. Uh, come on, come here, I, know what you I set him up, and he took the bait. Look how excited I look. <laughs> look at him. Look at him. That's me in high school. He's the kid I beat up. That's how he's seeing it. <laughs> Billy Nye, my old friend Billy Nye. You know him, the childhood scientist, jack-off fraud who's really a mechanical engineer, and that's true. Bill Nye deviated from his kid-friendly science guy persona on Sunday night to help hack left-wing John Oliver. You remember John Oliver. He's the one, he's the one that when Trump said he was thinking about running, he was going, please, please run. I will pay you to run. <laughs> we have to import jerk-offs from England uh, to talk about the severity of climate change. Nye proved he's not always the mild-mannered nerd millennials grew up with. Uh, when he joined uh, Oliver during his episode detailing carbon pricing and the Green New Deal. He says, uh, I'm happy to say Bill Nye has actually agreed to drive the urgency home at this point, this is Oliver talking, uh, by doing one of his enjoyable, lighthearted uh, demonstrations. And uh, I know damn well John Oliver's wrote this for him because this guy is about as funny as Kamala Harris, just fucking humorless. I'll show a clip of me and him that'll prove that. But... Uh, here, here, and this this was actually funny, okay? But because comedy writers wrote it, but it, you know, and they said curse it up or whatever, because it's HBO. I, it was actually funny. But here you go. His, his. Here, I, I've got an experiment for you. Safety glasses on. <laughs> By the end of this century, if emissions keep rising, the average temperature on Earth could go up another four to eight degrees. What I'm saying is, the planet's on fucking fire. <laughs> There are a lot of things we could do to put it out. Are any of them free? How about no, sitting on it? No, of course not. Nothing's free, you idiots. Grow the fuck up. You're not children anymore. I didn't mind explaining photosynthesis to you when you were 12, but you're adults now, and this is an actual crisis. Got it? Safety glasses off, motherfuckers. <laughs> uh, he realized he was a fucking nerd, and he's got to get hip, and he's a mechanical engineer is what he is, and a fucking fraud and a phony. But I got to say, that was funny. See, I'm a guy on the right who can laugh at shit. Like, you know, I can laugh at Bill Maher now and then, even though I'd behead him with a fucking spork tonight. <laughs> He's got one of my favorite jokes of all time. Bill Maher used to, this is when he first started comedy. He said, uh, I'm Catholic and Jewish, which means when I go to confession, I bring my lawyer. He's like, bless me, Father, for I have sinned. And I think, you know, Mr. Cohen... <laughs> It's a great joke. But uh, they're all full of shit. And, and uh, th that's Billy Nye, who, you know, he's a fucking oh, dope. fucking idiot. Yes, he is. I'm a fucking idiot. The tough-talking version of Nye gained widespread attention online, and he quickly became a trending topic on Twitter. Bill Nye is not the one we used to know. I never knew him, because, again, I was a weird little kid. I liked little girls and sports. Hated Dungeons and Dragons, did not watch Disney. You know, that's because my mother didn't hear me a Barbie doll when I was six. Say, so lick this. Uh, anyways, if you guys, I, I appeared with Bill Nye on uh, the Anthony Comia show, and I set him up beautifully. He took the bait, and then I bitch slapped him. Flunked out of University of Maine. <laughs> yeah. And you flunked out. Yeah. I think we're all shocked. It happened. I don't like your sarcasm, asshole. <laughs> Uh, uh, it ain't, ain't the fucking Bill Maher show, Bill. <laughs> or the John Oliver show. Uh, uh. Uh, I set him up, and he took the bait. Look how excited I look. <laughs> look at him. Look at him. That's me in high school. He's the kid I beat up. That's how he's seeing it. And, you know... He's the one to get A's. I wasn't bad in high school. 83 out of 400. Nothing to brag about, but, you know. <laughs> what can I tell you? But uh, Billy Nye and, and uh, John Oliver still has credibility after fucking laughing when Trump said he was going to run, and he said, please run. And um, you, You've been wrong about everything. I'm going to keep saying it. You, you were wrong about the goddamn election. You were wrong about the Mueller report. You know, just little things. 
Hey guys, when you get done cleaning the semen off your mouse pad, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube page and click on the little notification bell. That'll tell you when we go live and when we put clips up and stuff like that. Also, go to nickdip.com and uh, sign up at Patreon. That way you'll get three more shows a week. You can't get enough Nick DiPaolo, am I right? I thank you for your support, okay? See you later, Jackoffs.